in our Why Discernment is Important series, I'm going to tell you a little bit about myself. When I first came out of deception, after being in deception of many kinds, I fell into being hyper vigilant in trying to make sure that I didn't fall into deception again. So I looked everywhere. I was like, is that person telling the truth? Is that book in the truth? Is that movie in the truth? Can I trust this person? And so I became really hyper vigilant to make sure that I didn't fall into the same type of this deception or any other deception that was out there. So I was really in the Word of God, studying the Word of God. Now that I've been out for seven years, I've learned to look at more of a big picture of deception. What is something that is necessary to bring up when warning? What is something that doesn't need to be brought up? And what are those little things that really actually do need to be brought up because the big picture that it will lead to if it's not you know, brought up at the very root as it comes into the church. So using great wisdom in these days to understand what needs to be brought up and how can I bring it up in a loving way and to pray about those things before you would ever bring it to somebody's attention. I think that's one of the key thing about discernment is when it is used wrongly and when it is used with wisdom. And it's just a learning process for anybody that's been in discernment, called out of, you know, called out of uh, many different deceptions, set aside, was able to see looking back how it happened and how to be able to warn people going forward. And it's one of those walks, daily walks, to understand the ins and outs and what is something that is a salvage, salvation issue. What is something that could cripple the, the church? And when do you need to really um, tell a friend, here's a red flag, you know, these don't go in this direction, turn around, and ultimately know that you might be planting a seed, somebody might be watering that seed. We don't know the outcome, but the warning is set forth because we love people. And that's what it should always be about, your love to speak forth the truth and set forth warnings in these days, even if it costs you something.